Okay, hi there. So this is just a video about an error you might be getting um, when you're going to old projects. So this is happening to me. So for example, in Chartsvelt, so I made this a while ago, a few months ago, and I'm getting these error, can I find blah, blah, blah. Okay, so if you're getting some kind of error like this in some project that you're coming back to after a while, what you can do is just, you just need to delete the node modules and then run npm install again. Okay, so one thing you can do is code dot, well, if you have it installed, or go to your finder and just delete mo uh, node modules. You can also use the command line to just move the node modules to the trash. Okay, so I deleted them there and then I'm going to npm install. And hopefully I can get localhost 5000 to work again. Okay. Oh, that might be bad. npm audit fix. I don't know if that'll do anything. But let's see if the problem is fixed. If you're using a different project, then hopefully you don't have high security issues. Okay, and now it's back to working. Okay, so same thing with Sapper, though it might throw a different error. Okay, so this is something about unhandled promise rejection warning. Again, you can just open it up and move node modules to the trash or delete it or just do something to get it out of this folder. I mean, ideally you would just want to delete it because it's pretty useless outside of the folder. Okay, and then npm install. And this time it'll be localhost 3000. And I can delete that. But the end is going to be the exact same as before. npm run dev. Let's see if it starts running. So just to reiterate, delete your node modules and then run npm install. Cool. Now it's working. Uh, also, I do have a Patreon. If you want to, patreon.com slash sveltmaster. If you want to support me or if you like and subscribe, that helps a lot. And that is all for this video. Thank you very much.